hi welcome back to one more video tutorial if you are new to this channel you can subscribe my channel for more updates from toolbar select the pan tool and draw the roof of the houses Now select all and remove the outlines. Now draw a rectangle. Click on direct selection tool. Select this upper two points and drag it downward. Now select the rectangle and draw two small rectangles over it. Align it to the center. Now select this new rectangle and click on rotate tool, double click it and give 90 degree and copy. Now select all and click on minus font. Now uh, make it smaller in size. and put it here press and hold alt and drag it to make it copy similarly press and hold alt key and make one more copy now go to pen tool and draw a curve Now take this smooth tool and move over it to make the curve more smoother. Now duplicate this object and rotate it. Now select this direct selection tool, click on this lower knot and move this point move it more now give a boundary now select all the three lines 
go to shape builder tool and change the color here and click in the middle now take out this shape and uh, delete those lines Now duplicate this select the pen tool and draw a line over it now select this new line and the roof and go to shape builder tool press and hold alt key and delete this portion now let's draw the tree go to tool option and select pencil tool Now fill the tree with color. Now draw leaves. Go to toolbar and select this ellipse. Draw an ellipse. Uh, click on direct selection tool. Select this upper node. Select this lower node. And click here. Now select this point. Select this point. Take it downward. Now take this pen tool and make a gap. Select both and minus it. Make it smaller. and duplicate it like this Now select all and change the color. Here also change the color. Now make the tree smaller and place it here. Make a little bit bigger now. Now draw a rectangle. Now select the objects, go to shape builder tool. Now press and hold alt key on your keyboard and delete unwanted objects.
Now go to File and click on Save for Web. Mark this transparency and you can check the fit on the screen and save it. So let me save it in desktop. Now open Photoshop CS6. Now go to File and open Mockup. Again go to File and open Transparent Image that we have saved from Illustrator. Double click here. Click OK. Now drag this transparent image over mockup file. Click OK. You can increase the size. Now click here and unmark this and close this. Press yes. Now let us check the mockup. This way you can make your logo. Thank you for watching.